according to Jan in yesterday's video, this is going to get me mad because it's on New Year's Eve. Um, I've never had a New Year's kiss before. I also don't own a really cool hat. And this cardigan belongs to Jess. I don't own a cardigan. So I guess I'm not as cool. But I do own plenty of bow ties and headphones. Hold on, I'm getting my cold chain. For New Year's, I think that Jess and I are going to Sisters, which is a bar in Philly, uh, in Philly's neighborhood, which is just like a section of Philly that has lots of gay bars and things. Um, and it's $20 uh, open bar, so I'm pretty sure I can get my girlfriend's record up to just <laughs> with this face. This face can't get me in New Year's kids. Something is wrong. Uh oh. Let my chain hang low. It's hot. Cardigans are hot. No wonder I don't have one. Ugh. Oh. I also suggest rolling up the sleeves. It gives like a... I'm ready to party, but I'm also kind of ready to get down and dirty kind of feel. So the topics are Perfect New Year's Kiss and New Year's Resolution. I would suggest not getting too intoxicated for your New Year's kiss because you do want to remember it and so that's something that I might not be able to take my own advice on because <laughs> there's going to be an open bar which means all the drinks that you can double down in three hours. You know what's a really good thing to do? Play her a song. January like 2nd or 3rd they're like shoving their face with chocolate and totally forgot about that diet they were planning on going on or they're like chain smoking in the bathroom because they were supposed to quit smoking and making a New Year's resolution almost makes it harder for you to do whatever it is, it is that you're trying to do. I could make a New Year's resolution to lose 10 pounds but I bet you it would be 10 times easier to lose 10 pounds in May when it's getting close to bikini season or in my case board short season. Uh, than it would be for me to lose 10 pounds in the winter when I'm going to be, you know, sweaters and jackets all the time. So I don't really understand. I mean, I do get that I guess everybody's just trying to start fresh. New year, new look, new year, new, uh, new you. New year, new you. Good. Um, so, uh, my New Year's resolution is going to be to buy a cardigan and, um, some more fancy bow ties. You know what, make a New Year's resolution that you can keep. Because that's something that, you know, not a lot of people seem to have figured out. Make a New Year's resolution that, like, you know, my New Year's resolution is I'm, I'm starting right now. And my New Year's resolution is to get a New Year's kiss. And at 12.01, I'll have completed it. I'm going to be all y'all. So, try that. I got a new sweater. I found a new figure. It's really cute. Um, okay. Let's see. That will not get you a New Year's kiss, by the way. I mean... Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Um. I like this color. I don't have anything this color. This is like style pointer tips with lesbian central this week. Um. Alright. Enough talking about my clothing. I guess that's all for this week, guys. Um. Good luck on having a perfect New Year's kiss, whether you're single or with somebody. I hope it works out. And um, I hope you have a fun time. Be safe. Uh, a lot of people drink on New Year's, so just make sure you have a ride home or or, um, or you can call a cab or you just drink somewhere where you don't have to go anywhere. Um, and I will see you guys in 2012. <laughs> I just thought of that, like, awkward moment where someone thinks they're, like, so clever and the first person to think of saying something like, oh, well, I guess we'll see you next year. Uh, that aren't
You're not the first person to come up with that. Plenty of people have thought of that before you. I'll see you guys next year. I'm not trying to be clever and cute. I'm saying, for real, I'll see you guys next year. Because the next time I see you will be next year. But I know I didn't come up with that. I know that I wasn't the first person to, to think like, well, I guess we'll see you next year. <laughs> You want to be creative the next time you go out to eat at a restaurant and you're you know drinking a soda or water it and the waitress says do you want another one say no thanks i'm driving that's creative not see you next year Get it. um so anyway obviously i have some anger um my phone is broken so i have to go to verizon and fix that i got some little errands to run uh jess comes in tomorrow and i'm super excited and um i will see you guys later in new year um which is just a week from now well a couple days um, if I survive this open bar, I will see you then. Uh, have a good Thursday, and...